how to export composition on After Effects. So, how to export that video? You have created something like this beautiful text going from the left to the right, and you want to export it from After Effects. You need to put it somewhere else. You need to do something with that video. Don't look for an export something. It is right there in composition. You go in add to render queue. Render queue is right there between composition and it's on that line, render queue. And you have to set up that render. Starting with the render settings, come here. You have that screen. Of course, you want the best quality, the resolution full. You, unless you want to create a quick something and just see if it works. If you want to export it final, set it to full. The size, well, it's the size of your composition. Technically, on that screen, you don't really have nothing to modify. So, set, okay, that's great. Output module. So, about that format, I'll go on QuickTime, which is working on about everything today. You see, all those others are kind of old stuff. Well, they were great, but not today. Today we are working on computer, we go on YouTube. Everything we do is on computer. So, let's go for QuickTime. That's great. Now we have to choose for a format option. Here is the quality of your product. Keep it to 100, please. You just pass time to create something. Make it great. Make it look great. Now choose the video codec. There is two popular options depending on what you want to do. You can go on MPEG4 video, which will create a well compressed video. So you will have a great quality and the size of the file will be great. So if you want to go on the web directly, go for it. Now, if you want the full quality and more options with your video, you can go on animation, the first one. This will keep everything of your video, but create a huge file. Let's see what we can do with that. So the video output, we're working on RGB, but now because I choose animation, we don't have that with MPEG4 video, you can output the alpha. So if I go on RGB plus alpha, well, my text on the back, the text will be a text and which is black will be blank. There, there will be nothing. There will be alpha. So if I put that text on another video on a movie making software, well, let's say there is button in the back and my text in the front. Well, the text will be in front of the mountain instead of having black. So this is a great option. Color management, don't touch to it. That's fine. And then finally, well, choose where you want to export your video. See, so I want to set it in well, my After Effects folder and give a name, please, to your folder if you want to be well organized. So set save. And then finally, render right here. While it is rendering, I'm gonna looking for this file. See, it is rendering right now. Remember what I said earlier, when you create an animation file, it create huge files. See, that's a five seconds video. I, I know it's in 4k, but it's still five seconds and it's 54 megabyte or a text going from the left to the right with alpha. And here is my video, but since it's an animation, well, it's hard to read it like right there. You, you can most likely play it into movie making software. So if we want the video to be playable and directly going to YouTube or stuff like that, well, go again, composition, add to render queue. I have that seconds video. Well, we say for that it's all okay. And then go here in format option, choose that MPEG for video. See, now 
I can go on RGB plus alpha. So, and that's it. And export again, name two. Save and render. See, it's now creating another file. See, we got a 19.4 megabyte file, which will look the same than the other. See, that's a text. So this was how to export a video from After Effects. Pretty simple. So, yeah, thank you for watching. I hope it helps. Don't forget to subscribe. See ya! Oh, and take a look at my main channel. Right there.